YouTubers and all those who happen to watch. Hope you're all doing quite well. So, alright. There is one issue I had with Battlefield 4, at least on the PS4, and the right trigger, or in this case the R2 button, did not work. It had no motor function when it came to using sniper rifles. So, as you can see right here, with the recent uh, remapping thing that uh, the PlayStation had, at least with the PlayStation 4 allowing you to remap your buttons to whatever you wish, I can now do this. Give you a better view. Now I'm actually able to do so now. Now you're asking me, how the hell did he do that? Is he a magician? Well, sorry to tell you I'm not Harry Potter, but I could tell you at least how the hell I did it. So you go into options, and you new switch, the controls. You take the yellow pudding and you change the no, uh, basically you change the controls where it says R1 and R1, I'm sorry, L1 and R1 with L2 and R2. Then you go into the options on the PlayStation 4 by going into this settings. And then you go all the way down here to, if I can remember correctly, accessibility. Why not? Let's do some bold. There we go. Bold text. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. No, I'm kidding. Anyway, so basically what you do is you go into button assignments. Then you basically customize the buttons. So as you can see already here on the map system, I have it set where this is acting like it's L1 and that the bumper is acting like L2. Same with this. R1, R2. So now they're all acting as such on the system. Now I go back into the game. I'm sorry, the SRR61. Before anyone goes, that's an intervention, asshole. It's like, shh, 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 shh. We got this. Don't worry, we got this. So as you can see right here, I'll set it up like this. There we go. And then I can just fire as like this. Go towards the light. But there you have it. Works completely fine. And it proves my chaos theory. It was not necessarily because the R2 was crap. It was just because the coding that this game has with the with just PS4 controllers was some strange reason. It was just very funky. It's like any other game I've used this with or this set controller with has worked 110% fine. Where I was actually able to play these other games. Oops. I can learn how to drive sometime. But no, basically, I was actually able to play other games such as Shadowfall or whatever else without issue. So it was sort of like, you know, it isn't the controller's fault necessarily. It was just battle or bun. Or I was called a bungee. <laughs> Dice. Uh, basically just some strange reason did not know how to code controller schemes or algorithms or whatever you wish to call the technical term or the flat term for the controls to even make them function correctly with the said game. And this same issue with games such as uh, Hardline. With Hardline, same control issue. It just does not allow you to fire sniper rifles. So... I'm pretty happy that the fact I can actually use my sniper rifle now. I, I'm doing some cartwheels, Cisco style. Let me see your thong. Baby thong, the thong, thong, thong. But either way, just makes me very happy in the pants. But anyway, if this helps you out with the said issue that we were having with sniper rifles working correctly with Battlefield 4, then hey, all is well in the world. Oh, I got the guy in the shoulder. Cool. Oop. I would have died. Oop. Oop. I suck. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. Oh, I got the guy in the shoulder too. Cool. But yeah. I'm going to continue practicing my shots. Take it easy. Thank you all for touching my nipples.